Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna to review a game changer for all you macro photography enthusiasts. This is the Laowa 85 millimeter macro photo lens. Let's dive in and see if it's worth all the hype. First, let's talk about the specs and the build quality. The Laowa 85 millimeter macro lens is designed for both DSLRs and mirrorless cameras. The version I have is for the Canon RF mirrorless mount. The first thing I noticed about this lens was its amazing compact small design. It's the perfect lens to take on the go and it won't tire you out on a long day's shoot. The Laowa 85 millimeter lens has a maximum aperture of f5.6 a minimum focusing distance of 16 centimeters or approximately 6.3 inches and offers a two to one magnification ratio. The lens is also manual focus only. The build quality is also very impressive with an all metal construction that gives you a premium feel. It has a smooth focus ring, which is essential for precise focusing in macro photography. Keep in mind there is no weather sealing, and since it is full manual, you won't get to utilize autofocus. In addition, you won't be able to get any XF data when you import your photos. Now for the most important aspect, image quality. I've been using this lens for a couple months now, and I must say the results are breathtaking. Previously, I was using extension tubes, but I have definitely noticed sharper images when using the Lawa alone on my camera body. Here are some sample images I've taken of insects. The sharpness is amazing, even at the maximum magnification. The colors are vibrant. The out of focus areas have beautiful creamy bokeh. Chromatic aberration and distortions are minimal, which is always a plus. In low light situations, the f5.6 aperture might seem limiting. However, with today's high ISO capabilities in most camera bodies, and with using a tripod, you can still get stunning macro shots with this lens. My main use with this lens has been with insects, which don't always stay still for very long, so you have to use a high enough shutter speed to take photos. And, as we know, with higher shutter speeds in your camera, light becomes more limited. To compensate for the high shutter speed, I've introduced flash and a diffuser, specifically this one designed by AK Diffuser. I'll make a separate video about my specific flash setup to cover the technical aspects, but essentially the diffuser acts as a giant softbox for insects. Let's quickly recap the pros and cons of the Laowa 85 millimeter macro photo lens. Number one, the impressive two to one magnification ratio. Number two, the amazing size and portability of this lens. Number three, the excellent image quality. And number four, the smooth manual focus ring. And last but not least, number five, the overall build quality. And of course, we have some cons. Number one, being that it's manual focus only. Number two, the limited low light performance. And number three, the lack of weather sealing. So, is the Laowa 85mm macro lens worth it? If you're serious about macro photography and need that extra 2 to 1 magnification, it's an absolute no-brainer. For another lens of this magnitude, you'd be expecting to pay 3 times as much the cost. Despite being manual focus and having some limitations in low light, the image quality and build make it a fantastic option for any photographer looking to up their macro game. Not to mention the small construction and compact design make it the perfect lens to carry on long shoots. It won't tire you out like some of its larger counterparts. That's it for today's review. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more reviews. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.